In this video tutorial, I am going to show you how to view live video on a web page. You can use the IP admin tool or enter the IP address manually in the browser to connect. For those of you who have the IP admin tool, you can access it by double clicking on the SDK folder. It can be found in bin, tools, admin tool and then the IP admin tool.exe. And this will bring up a window that shows the devices that are available. The IP admin tool automatically discovers all the network devices that I can connect to and shows the product name, IP address, MAC address, firmware, etc. Next, you need to connect to a device by selecting a device, right click and then selecting Web View. And this will bring up Internet Explorer along with a website security error which can be safely ignored by clicking on the continue link. Click on the ActiveX alert pop-up and install the ActiveX control. The ActiveX control is needed to display the video. After a few seconds, this will take you to the ordinary encoder display where you can view live video. For those of you who don't have the IP admin tool, you can double click on Internet Explorer and type in your IP address in the following format and then repeat the same steps. If you don't know the IP address, then you can find the default IP address by locating the MAC address on the back of your IP video encoder and then convert the last two hexadecimal numbers to decimal. For example, if the last two bytes of the MAC address of your unit are 14B1, then the last two bytes of the IP address will be 20.177 as 14 and B1 in hexadecimal represents 20 and 177 in decimal. You can calculate this quickly by going to Start, Programs, Accessories, Calculator and then click on View and change to Scientific Mode. Tick the hexadecimal tab, type the number for example B1 and then tick the decimal tab to get the result which is 177 in this case.